The way prostitution is viewed may be changing. Wisconsin's Attorney General says he believes some people are realizing that some prostitutes may in fact be victims of sex trafficking. And now he wants the state to do more to protect those who are victims. Fox 11's Andrew Lacombe has multiple views. It's every single day in our neighborhood. Connie Campbell of Appleton believes sex trafficking is a modern form of slavery. She runs an organization called Five Stones with the mission of fighting trafficking. This is not a crime where a victim comes forward. Wisconsin's Attorney General hopes that will change as the public learns more about the issue. People are correctly recognizing that people who have been termed as prostitutes in the past uh, aren't necessarily so. J.B. Van Hollen and a bipartisan group of lawmakers have created a bill that would change the way human trafficking cases are handled in court. Those changes include allowing victims to have a prostitution conviction erased, limiting the ability to prosecute minors engaged in prostitution, and giving victims greater rights to confidentiality. This uh, bill, amongst many other things, gives them an opportunity to, to try to at least set the record straight a little bit and give themselves a second chance in life. Brown County District Attorney David Lassay says right now it's difficult to get trafficking victims to come forward. These are difficult cases because of the underlying uh, background of the, of the victims, the uh, situation they find themselves in. They often go unreported. Lassay hopes the bill continues to make progress in Madison. Committees in the Assembly and Senate have already held hearings on the bill. If and when the legislation passes, Campbell still doesn't think many victims will step forward. But when there's laws being written just for them, I hope that it edifies their position and the fact that they do matter and that we need to, we need to care. And her fight continues. Not one thing is going to do it. It's a multiple of things, and that law is, is a great, great beginning. Campbell encourages anyone who sees evidence of human trafficking to call local law enforcement. Andrew Lacombe, Fox 11 News. Lassay suggested a new law would mean more work for his staff, but he said he's okay with that.